This is the activity on yet another algebraic identity. The objective of this activity is to verify the algebraic identity of A plus B whole cube. The identity is A cube plus 3A square B plus 3AB square plus B cube. Let's see the concept behind this. In the expansion of A plus B whole cube, we have to multiply A plus B three times. So A plus B, A plus B and A plus B. When you multiply A plus B two times, you get A square plus 2AB plus B square. And when you multiply this trinomial by the binomial A plus B, you get six terms A cube plus A square B plus 2A square B plus 2AB square plus ab square and plus b cube so if you combine the like terms you can see a pair of like terms here and a pair of like terms here you get a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube which is the algebraic identity we are trying to prove through activity this is the algebraic proof but we can do it through an amazing activity let's see what is the uh, material required for this particular activity. So as you can see here, we require glazed paper, then scale, then fevicol for pasting work, cardboard, scissor and sketch pens. Let's see how we can perform this activity now. To derive the identity A plus B whole cube, we need a cube in which you can see all the sides like if you see this particular side this is a and this is b so the edge of this particular cube is a plus b if you turn it and you see any other edge you will find a and b so the edge is a plus b all the 12 edges are the same and therefore the volume of this particular cube is a plus b whole cube because the formula for finding the volume of a cube is the cube of the side so this is a cube of volume a plus b whole cube now how do we derive the identity we divide this cube into smaller cubes and cuboids by cutting it vertically and horizontally so you can see we have separated it out into various different 3D shapes. These are the smaller shapes which you can see. This is a small cube and this small cube has the side B because the, the I told you B is the smaller length and A is the larger length. This is a cuboid whose dimensions are you have A, this is A, the length and then this is b and this is also b so a b and b and likewise you have many other cuboids also in this when we separate out all this big cube into smaller ones we obtain these eight different solids you can see the big one here this is a cube which has side a everywhere it is a and therefore the volume of this cube is a cube now let's take this particular solid you have the dimensions as a here a here the length and breadth are both a the height is b because i told you in the beginning b is the smaller length and therefore the volume of this cuboid is a square b because a times a times b is a square b how many such cuboids we have we have three such cuboids right so three cuboids the combined volume is 3a square b and likewise if you see this we have this as a this is b and this is also b so the volume of this particular cuboid will be a and b square because a times b times b is the volume we have three such cuboids 
and therefore the volume will be 3 ab square and finally we have this small cube the edge of this small cube is b and therefore b times b times b is the volume that is b cube if you add the volume of all the eight small solids obviously these small solids were made from the big cube therefore the volume of big cube and the combined volume of the eight solids will be equal and that derives our identity a plus b whole cube equal to a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube you can cut these cubes from a big thermocol sheet or you can make it using foam and prepare your activity accordingly.